We begin tonight in southern Colorado, where a sheriff believes his investigator stopped a mass shooting from taking place on a university campus. A 24-year-old student is now in custody after his cache of weapons was spotted on campus. It happened at Colorado State University Pueblo. The arrest came yesterday. Tonight, the sheriff is thanking all those who reported suspicious activity. CBS 4's Jeff Todd on our top story tonight from that Pueblo campus. Jeff, what's the latest? Well, Jim, really what got investigators to move quickly was when they spotted how much ammunition and tactical gear this suspect had. We're told that the threats were made against staff and students here on campus, and the sheriff really credits reporting those threats that got this suspect arrested quickly before harm was done. On Monday, investigators came to this on-campus apartment complex and set up surveillance on 24-year-old Robert Killis. The student at CSU Pueblo has former military experience, according to the sheriff's office, and had been making threats, telling other students and faculty that he liked to kill people. His truck was spotted in a parking lot, and the detective said they could see ammunition, a bulletproof vest, and a large gun case. Surveillance continued into the next day, and Tuesday, Killis was arrested off campus. The sheriff's office says during the arrest, they found a loaded semi-automatic rifle, a shotgun, a handgun, and several loaded high-capacity magazines. The confusion spread on Wednesday when students on campus were sent a safety alert saying Killis was arrested, but then added if he was seen on campus, he was considered dangerous, and that alert urged people not to make contact with him. A second alert reassured the weary students that Killis was in jail, and another notification will be sent out if he is ever released. Killis is being charged with possession of a weapon on a college campus. It's actually illegal to have a weapon on all college campuses across the whole state. He's being held on a half million dollar bond and despite all that confusion is in jail tonight. We are live in Pueblo tonight. Jeff Todd covering Colorado first.